How similar was it to like MMA? Like the mindset? Yeah, just just like the fight mindset. It was it was it was pretty. Um, it's a little bit different because I feel like in MMA with a lot of people, like when I talk to other people, like I don't I don't do it <clears throat> um, competitively anymore. I just train, but when like you talk to other people. Their biggest worry is looking like an idiot. <clears throat> and right. they're worrying about another guy, you know, whooping them. Right. For me, you know, I'm like, dude, I don't have any problem with, <laughs> with an 1,800-pound bull whooping me because that's what it's supposed to do, right. you know? So it's a little bit different than that. But um, the mindset leading up to it is, is it's pretty much the same. I mean, you're really... Because, I mean, honestly, I'm not just trying to stay on for eight seconds like I'm actually thinking like I'm trying to because I mean dude eight seconds seems like nothing right dude, it's the longest it's oh the longest man. eight seconds of your life you can't experience that until you experience it like it's it's insane but me I was like uh I was just trying to focus on <clears throat> what uh what to do next because there's a lot of it you ain't just sitting on a bull and you just try to hang on like Dude, you got spurs on, and you're trying to just hold on for dear life, and 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 move your hips and move your shoulders in the correct position to yep to to do it. It's, it's how different was your your shoot procedure thought process from the first one to the second one? Because the first one you don't really know what to think. Yeah, the first one I was I was kind of just like listening to y'all, and just like okay, I remember what you told me about keeping my legs pinched. It's not gonna be that hard. It's yeah. just gonna turn out of here. Yeah, and honestly, like when you guys were, you know, you guys put in my head that he's not gonna, he's not gonna go crazy, you know. Right. But <clears throat> even with him not going that crazy and bucking that hard, it's still like it's still a lot of power that you're dealing with. It's just like it's like compression in your body or something, you know. And <clears throat> I, uh, in the second time though, I was like, right whenever I got on him, I was like, I'm ready, like, yeah, you know. And we talked about some things that I did wrong with my hand after the fact which is kind of why i wanted to do it again i guarantee everybody watching out there i would do it again i, I know you again. would yeah there's no doubt in my mind 